What's up everybody, Blake and Nat here. So we're installing car seats. Yes, car seats, you guys know we're on twins. Now, we've been told by the doctor that we could expect them within two to three weeks. So we're finally installing car seats. So let me so, flip this around. I did this one, I read all the instructions. It's actually easier than I expected. I got, I, of course, we're gonna go get it checked to make sure I did it correctly. But basically you can do it one of two ways. If you don't know, there's anchors here on every car. I've always wondered what they're for. Well, they're for car seats. You can do it also with your seat belt. I just felt like the anchors, that's what they're there for. And it's probably a little bit more secure. And so what are these, Natalie? Greco? Yeah. Car seats. So we're a little bit worried. This is Natalie's car. We're kind of like wanting a new car. So I think that we're just trying to come up with excuses to get a new car. But dude, we are gonna break our backs bending over like this. I wish it was like a little bit higher up. Now like a Tahoe, right? <laughs> we, need, we need like an escalator, a Tahoe. So they're actually like, this is actually really, really simple. Like all these are already in here, like all of the cords and stuff. So basically I'm gonna try to do this one handed here. You go under that, find your little anchor and it clicks there like a seat belt on both sides. Literally that's it. Then I'm gonna tighten that up. Uh, that's all wonky. Yeah, we're gonna fix it. I just wanna show them what to do. Pull that tight, push down, pull it tight as you can. Lock that in, check your level to make sure it's leveled correctly and you can adjust it from the back. And that's literally it. Like it's it's actually really, really simple. Hey, maybe we'll go viral on you in Sonic the car seat. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. <laughs> but really that's it, man. That's they said fire stations don't love when people take it. But we're probably gonna take it to like the hospital and have them check it out. Actual inspection stations that you like look like your zip code, you type it in and then it tells you where to take it. Oh really? Mm -hmm. Let's get a new car. I kind of would have felt silly if we would have taken that to the fire station and had them do it. I know. That's probably why they don't love doing it. Yeah. It but like it's going to be good to get it inspected at least. Oh, we have to get it inspected. Let's get, yeah, let's get a new car. <laughs> All right, now here's a test to see if you can get it in. Let's see. Boom. Is that it? That's it. But I'm taking it out. <laughs> You know Just I mean. pull it, the handle on the back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, watch. You like you want to like pull up one, before right? you pull out. Yes. <laughs> no, watch. There's the handle on the back. Kind of clasp. The like kind of. Kind of like grab the top of this and go like that. See? You pull the handle up and then pull out. And now it's free. And it's the big handle, not the hook handle? Yeah, right here. Like the big handle, yeah. Okay, do what? We don't want to give our kids shake a baby syndrome. Do what? Like kind of grab the back of the car seat and pull. Like clamp and then pull up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm bad, man. <laughs> no, you're not. Okay, ready? Like, pull it. Yep, see? Now pull up. Are you not squeezing it hard enough? Oh, man. <laughs> you can bring it for nine months. I haven't been in a while. You think that's why? I don't know. But the kids are going to be locked in here if you can't get them out. At least I'll be with you for four months. Okay. Ready? See the back here? Put your thumb here and pull up like that. And it just slides back in here. All right, here's the test. Okay, hang on. <laughs> okay. I can't even do this. I suck. Do you see me doing it? I'm doing it, right? Ah. Oh. There you go. <laughs> That's the base. For anybody that doesn't have a car seat, there you go. They go in super easy. Yeah, if we're missing anything, leave us a comment, because seriously, we don't know. 
I'm just I'm just going by the instructions, but we are gonna get this inspected because I don't totally trust myself. I wonder if there's any firefighters. Any firefighters if watching, let us know if we did it right. I hope we did. And it seems a little shaky. I don't know. It seems a little shaky. We're gonna get them checked out. But please don't don't use this video as a for sure tutorial because I don't wanna be liable. But yeah. Now I think we need a new car. It's kind of tight. It's not as bad as I thought. It's not as bad as I thought, but it's still tight. Let me try to sit up here. Like it's gonna be tight up here, man. Natalie, I don't. Have, do I have any room? You have like a tiny bit. Like that? Yeah, that's fine. And then if you want to go back a little bit, you can. I'd rather go back like that. Is that it? Yeah, that's all you got, buddy. My goodness. It's not bad. Like, Wait, what about you driving? Well, it's the same thing. I'll be fine. I mean, it's still tight. It's still tight. New car. What would we get? Leave us a comment down below. And everybody's going to say minivan. You got twins. We you need a minivan. a minivan. We really don't want a minivan. I got I just don't want a it's minivan. It's not even about the fact that I don't want to drive a minivan. I just think there's cooler cars that are bigger. Yeah, we just want to drive a minivan. Leave us a comment. What car should we get? And, uh, I don't know. Natalie, we could do it. It's just I don't want to. I mean, it's fine. Like, I don't want to drive in this because it is kind of tight. Like, look at my knees. Like, I, I'm a... You don't have much room. I'm, I mean, I am tight. Like, my knee... My knees are touching. If I sit up, they're not, but it's a little tight. Man, first world problems, Natalie. We're gonna be fine. Where are we gonna be going? Maybe we, maybe we can get one in like springtime. You say that, but we have to go to the doctor. Well, we're gonna be driving my truck. Well, you better Do we have other bases? Yeah. We have it's four bases. So we have two for her car, two for, do you realize some people only have to buy like one base? Like they're just gonna use their <laughs> one car. We have to buy four of them. But my truck will be fine. I have a lot of room in my truck. Let's just get you a truck. You want a truck? Just a big old truck. But that's really it now. Show them, show them Christmas. We've already showed them Christmas, haven't we? Have we showed them all this? I'm pretty sure we showed them all I don't know. Do we have to edit that video? What video? The video, you know how the other day before we put that one up and you were like, no, I feel like there's another one that we have to do. I don't know, Natalie. I don't, I don't, don't remember. remember. But, but it was like about our anniversary and like us setting up Christmas. I don't know. I don't remember. I don't, did we ever put that video up? You know, We're terrible. We've been super busy this. It's been a great weekend though. It's only Saturday. I know. Thanksgiving. Hope everybody had a good Thanksgiving. Natalie, what's one thing you're thankful for? Me, that was exactly what I was gonna say. Mm -hmm. And babies, yeah, and babies. thankful that everybody's healthy and happy. You know? Okay. We well, yeah, that's a. There's no lay under the tree, and then we'll have our two presents here <laughs> underneath the tree. Best presents in the world. The best presents that are coming soon. Maybe we could get a new car for Christmas. Yeah. Sure, there's Black Friday deals somewhere in the world. Probably not. I don't think they do Black Friday on car, you don't think uh, on they, cars. You don't think they just try to get you in? Those well, they probably try to get you in. I just don't like dealing with car salesmen. If somebody really gave me a good deal on a car, we would do it in a heartbeat. I just don't like going to the car dealer and spending my whole day and wasting a bunch of time and getting screwed over and stuff, you know? All right, now, this is the car seats. Leave us a comment what car we should get and if we did the car seats right. I hope we did. I hope we did too. Are you excited about it though that I got it done? Now he's been bugging me for like months and months and months. And this is the last nice day. It's going to snow tomorrow and the babies are coming. So I'm like, you know what? I'll just do it. Good job. I'm All right. Good job, babe. Good job. All right. See you guys. That's, that's installing car seats. And literally, we talk about getting a new car every single day. We have for since springtime and it's winter so like almost the whole year and we just can't quite pull the trigger on it but all right guys i hope you have a great rest of your day thanks for watching
Peace. Bye. All right, so we have a little issue to add here to this video. This is me driving as far back as I possibly could be <laughs> with the car seat in. Now, I don't know if I can drive more than 15 minutes. And listen, it sounds like we're just trying to justify a new car, but this is serious. Well, yeah, I, this if has we to got be dangerous. in an accident, I'm telling you, if we got in an accident, the airbag would come out and break your legs. Dude, like, I'm not gonna lie, I'm super uncomfortable. Like, really, really uncomfortable. I like to sit way back. Well, you like to but, sit with the seat all the way back. That's probably yeah. as far as I sit with the seat back. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna be possible. Like, we, we literally want to be able to drive more than, like, 15 minutes because I'm super super uncomfortable. Do I have to get off here? Oh, uh, yeah But you know what? I don't know Natalie if it's gonna impede my safety We need to figure something out or you're just never gonna drive again But even writing now, uh, I don't know Writing's probably a little bit better, but not a whole lot Well, and you have to drive home from the hospital. So like I said, we could drive my truck to the hospital I'm not worried about the hospital. It's like long term. Like we're gonna have to figure something out. Oh yeah, this isn't gonna work. Cause like when the kids do get older, like then you flip them around and stuff. But it's not gonna get like we're just gonna be traveling more. Like but that's like going further away when they get older. That's like a long time from now when you flip them. Okay, Natalie. What? You know what I'm saying. No, I'm agreeing with like, you. Like, I'm not saying older. I'm saying, like, even, like, a year down the road, we'll be driving them more places than we will, like, the first couple months. I know. Oh, Natalie, we're going to go spend a bunch of money. <laughs> what are we... Hey, this is a beautiful sunset, but this is for real. We had to show you this because I really don't know what we're going to do. Leave us a comment. Best car for children. Twins. For twins. Twins. <laughs> for twin babies. I want them. Never mind. We're not getting a Tesla. But it, I'm s dead serious. I seriously think the best car out there for twins or just babies in general is a Tesla Model X because the way the doors open, you would be able to get them in and out of their car seats standing up, not hunched over. Well, you trying wouldn't have to, get to bend over, would you? No. Trying to get it in this door was crazy. That's why I said this car needs to be a little bit higher up. Huh. What a mess, Natalie. I know. What a mess. What are we going to do? I don't know. We were going to buy a car in the springtime. Can you we imagine? Knew. Before we knew it was twins, we, were, we literally almost bought a car. We would have lost so much money because we would have lost money in that deal. Lost money selling that car. Now we're just going to lose money once, but... I'm just gonna get you a minivan. <laughs> All right, I just had to add that in there because now we really have to figure something out. At first, Ugh. earlier today, we we're just kind of like complaining, but for real, I'm not gonna be able to drive an hour somewhere like this. No, I'm gonna hurt. I've already got back problems. Yeah. No. Okay. All right. See ya.